Hello, and welcome back to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center. According to internal provisions, all applicants must complete this test series for testing series tests. Before we start, however, please note that serious injuries may occur. The Enrichment Center is proud to announce that your family will be notified in the event of a work fatality with no additional garnishment to your wages. Your first task is to build a bridge so that a test vehicle can reach the test chamber exit. First we need to remove the useless assembly left by your predecessor, and we don't mean their family. Excellent. Your ability to destroy without question is quite impressive. Next, we will supplant a new construction using Aperture Science Convertible Scaffold Planks. The bridge still requires a roadway for the test vehicle to drive on. Fortunately, each Aperture Science Convertible Scaffold Plank can be converted into a roadway and vice versa at any time. Very good. Let a test vehicle run over.
Welcome to Test Chamber 2. To overcome obstacles, you will often need to construct your bridge uphill or downhill. This roadway leads uphill, but is not suitable for vehicles. However, instead of destroying these components, we will modify their location. Very good. Now build the supports underneath. Excellent. The first bridge is ready. Now we will construct a vehicle ramp for hurdling to the exit. Please observe this test chamber layout and note that it is impossible for the vehicle to reach its destination. For this task, the test chamber will be enhanced with an Aperture Science Quantum Tunnel, or more commonly called, a portal. The portal will open in 3, 2, 1. Any vehicle that enters one side of the portal will instantly exit from the other side at the same speed. Your rapid progress has demonstrated that even the simplest employees can doodle a bridge, while our expert drivers handle the complex physics of navigating through portals. Very good. Testing procedure requires that this test will not allow supporting the bridge from below. However, we can use the construction attachment points above to suspend the bridge with Aperture Science multi-purpose multi -purpose super cables consist of tightly rolled shower curtains and can be stretched over long distances. Perfect. Now send the vehicle through the portal. Don't worry. These intradimensional gates have been proven completely safe for custodial staff. Please note. To protect valuable testing apparatus, 
Vehicle drivers are not permitted to make contact with the deadly fluid on the chamber floor. Your employee photo will be provided in the vehicle driver's cause of death form in the event of your failure. Multiple pairs of portals can exist at the same time. One of them is leading to a deadly laser field. It appears red to discourage casual contact. I am registering an increased heart rate and galvanic skin response, obviously due to the fact that you are not able to tell which portal will lead the vehicles into the lethal deadlock. To compensate for your lack of clairvoyant abilities, we will alter the portal spectral radiance. From now on, interlinked portals will always have matching colors.
This test chamber only has construction attachment points at the start and end of the road. In such cases, the bridges must be self-supporting with arch scaffolds placed in a triangular formation. We provided two bridges as structural reference. It should be a simple matter of copying this design to bridge the remaining gaps. Please note the closed door before the exit. At least one vehicle must press the blue Aperture Science One Touch Super button to open the door to the exit. Vehicle pads may cross when there are several portal pairs. But please don't panic as this may distract the drivers. 
To compensate for a broad range of applicant ability, the Enrichment Center is required to provide all applicants, especially you, with useful advice. The advice for this test chamber is as follows. Build a steer so that air should for exit. Very simple.
Remember that vehicles will maintain their speed when driving through a portal. As you can see, it will need a lot of speed to hurdle the middle wall. The Enrichment Center would like to remind you that the entire vehicle must reach the exit to earn a positive mark on your testing record. For other critical testing anecdotes, please refer to the Library of Best Practices, which is now available to you effective immediately.
Please note that this test chamber's exit is very near the top. The vehicle drivers will need speed and crossing paths to complete this test on your behalf. We believe in you, Applicant 9723. If you are not Applicant 9723, please submit a sporadic encouragement request form 274 days prior to testing.